The Philippines is now suffering from degradation of the natural environment. Most of the environment here is now polluted due to abuse. Ground and surface water contamination, local flooding, air pollution, exposure to toxins, deforestation, biodiversity loss, food waste, global warming, ozone layer defension are just some of the problems of our natural environment. You, Sayuna, do you know how Mother Earth helped us? Do you know how important the benefits of the environment to us? Do you know how to help the environment just like the way they help us? Most of us don't realize how special the Earth was. God created the environment with its natural beauty and produces great benefits to all. But somehow, humans are still celebrating because we earn great benefits while the environment is now suffering. We don't know what we had until it was all done. This planet depends on us. We can get back the beauty of the environment that God gave us by planting more trees to avoid climate change because of deforestation. Stop the deforestation and keep the forest full of beautiful trees to prevent floods and drought. Educate or speak up to help others understand how important our Mother Earth was. Proper knowledge and education on the four R's are a must for waste management. Stop creating fossil fuels including coals, petroleum, natural gas, heavy oils, and more. They produce carbon dioxide and other greenhouse gases that may trap heat in our atmosphere that may result global warming and climate change. Plastic usage is rampant ever since, and with the emerge of this pandemic, its use has doubled. Research has shown that in the Philippines, it is estimated that 48,967,769 pieces of face masks are used on the daily. For the whole Southeast Asia, 295,458,617 face masks are used. And collectively for Asia, it amounts up to 2.2 million pieces of face mask. With this, face mask became an additional to what will and have entered in our bodies of water that causes pollution, detrimental to our environment. Most countries around the globe generate excessive waste. Therefore, evaluation of waste disposal and management systems and techniques are utmost important to all living creatures. Thus, used plastics slowly turns into microplastics that has great impact on marine wildlife, neighboring shores, and ecosystems. With face masks coming into the water, Hygiene and health are in concern. Marine pollution kills and estimates 100,000 marine mammals, turtles, seabirds, and a great number of fish are affected. It is devastating for fisheries and the tourism industry. Reasons why they enter oceans are when they are littered around carelessly and the waste management systems fails or is inadequate. Growing population equates to growing waste that each individual uses and dispose. Merrily, take note that we have only got one planet to live in. And with pollution and irresponsible selfish acts, we disrupt the essence of living in a prohibited realm. In summary, we humans are not the only living beings in this earth. We share this with other living beings that have every right to live in a harmonious biodiversity. Consumption is entirely selfish to put into words, but having concern to others and its surroundings is a selfish act of kindness. Advocacy in Solving Environmental Problems and Issues by Ryan J.D. Romero